happen to you? You have a hot date with your hubby later on, but your hair is an absolute mess. And yet, at the same time, the big hockey match is on, and you have no time to get your hair done. Introducing sports clips for girls. <laughs> The only sport hair cuttery where you can watch the big game while you're getting your hair done. This hair cuttery is the only hair spot for women by men. <laughs> Let me tell you a little bit about our founder. This is Gordon Logan. Gordon completed his undergraduate degree at Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Okay, during this time, he realized that women aren't given the same opportunities as men. He realized that women are left out of spaces. And so Gordon wanted to make a space where women would feel comfortable, which is why he decided to make Sport Clips for Girls, a hair salon just for women and their sports. At Sport Clips for Girls, you can take advantage of our state-of-the-art flat-screen TVs, showing sports such as figure skating, artistic swimming, ballet, and dog shows. And just wait till you see our stylists. Hubba hubba. <laughs> All of our stylists go through rigorous testing to ensure that they are only attracted to women, okay? <laughs> These are some of the services you can expect at Sports Clips for Girls. We have the par for the course. That gets you just a normal haircut, okay? No shorter than that, though. You can also get the pas de deux which is the par for the course, and we add on a tampon, okay? <laughs> um, these are other haircuts, but we don't offer them at Sport Clips for Girls because they're too gay. <laughs> Here's some testimonials from happy customers. Renee F. from the suburbs says, my wedding day was on the same day as the International Dressage Finals. I wanted to look good for my special day. And I wanted to look good for my wedding, too. <laughs> Thankfully, Sport Clips for Girls saved the day. Thanks, Fabio, and the entire Sport Clips for Girls team. Thank you, Renee. Anne C. from Palm Beach, Florida says, Between my conservative commentary and my cross-stitch Confederate flag Etsy shop, I barely have time for myself. Sport Clips for Girls lets me maintain my luscious locks without missing a single stroke of the LPGA Tour. <laughs> Thanks, Anne. Uh, no hair cutting place would be a good hair cutting place without a little bit of community outreach. At Sport Clips for Girls, we have a program called Help a Shiro, where we help women who are shiros. <laughs> We also provide military aid because there's nothing that girls like more than a well-funded military. <laughs> Finally, cancer is a very important topic, which is why we do cancer for kids and give kids cancer. Okay. <laughs> oh, I know what you're thinking, fellas. Any fellas out here? Yeah. yeah. You're thinking, where's my sport clips? What, what if I want to watch the big game and get my hair done? Introducing sport clips for boys. Similar idea, but it's for boys, and uh, we show boy sports here. Um, and so I don't want to sit here and bore you with the details of sport clips for boys. So I'm just going to point you to additional an additional resource. So. Uh, Introducing Sport Clips for Boys, the podcast. <laughs> now, I encourage all of you to go home and do your own research. If you go to the Sport Clips website, you'll see that these uh, podcast topics do in fact exist in real life. And they include things guys care about, such as 
Living sports clips values. Uh. Balancing family in sport clips. Escaping domestic abuse slash intimate partner violence and addiction. <laughs> The fun of putting together the perfect karaoke video as a team. <laughs> and finally, surviving a house fire and cancer with help from Wayne McLone Fund. <laughs> Just classic guy stuff. <laughs> so you might be thinking, well, I can't decide which sport clips is right for me. Well, I made a handy little flowchart. Let's walk through it together. What's your gender? I am girl or I am boy? <laughs> For me, I am girl. <laughs> so I go to sports clips for girls. If you said I am boy, you go to sports clips for boys. And uh, there are only two genders, and that's the end of my talk. <laughs>